Good day, wonderful family. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. Thank you for always stopping by. In today's video, I want to share with us a very powerful recipe you can use to scatter all your enemies. Yes, no matter where they are, as long as they have declared themselves your enemies, they will not let you drink water and keep calm. They will not let, let you succeed in this life. This recipe is very, very powerful for that. Okay, but in case you're tuning in for the first time or you're seeing my face for the first time, you're highly welcome. Kindly hit the red subscribe button to make yourself a full member of the family. Like my videos, share my videos, and do not forget to turn on your notification bell so that you'll be the first to be notified each time I upload new videos on YouTube. And if you're a returning subscriber, thank you, thank you. I really appreciate it. May God Almighty continue to bless you in all you do. Now, many people complain that things are not working well for them as a result of evil people in the society. Some of them don't sleep, don't some of them don't rest because of you know because of us. They are restless, they just want us to go down, but by the grace of God, nothing will happen to us. They will strike and they will never get to us. Whatever they do, we must go back to them. But I always ask, I always tell people to make sure that their hands are clean. Yes, this is Ember Month, uh, Christmas period. Many of us will be traveling home. Many people will travel and come back with sicknesses from the evil people. Some people will come back you know, and start having financial issues. But by the grace of God, when you carry out this recipe, there is no amount of arrow they will throw on you that will work. If the, the spell is already working on you, please go ahead and do this recipe. It is going to be destroyed by the special grace of God. And make sure as you're trying to get free, uh, freedom for yourself, make sure you have not tied anybody down. Yes, it's a two-way thing. Make sure your hands are clean so that when God is fighting for you, he will fight for you in full force and the victory must be yours. You cannot be fighting for freedom while you're wickeding somebody, while you're tying somebody's destiny somewhere. No. The grace of God doesn't work that way. Make sure your hands are clean. Yes. Please, so many people have been complaining. I've not been replying to the chat lately. I have been so busy offline. Please bear with me. Okay? Please bear with me. After what I'm doing today, I'm going to sit down and reply all the chats I've not replied by the grace of God. Now, straight to the video. What is required to get this recipe done is pepper. This is my pepper. Yes, the people in Nigeria are familiar with this pepper. This is Cameroon pepper. I don't eat pepper, so I have to go and get this for this work. You can use this type of pepper, okay, for our brothers and sisters outside that uses this kind of pepper. Any kind of pepper you have, as long as it's called pepper, you get it for me. Then the next ingredient is this. A bottle of water like this. Get any kind of bottle. It may not be exactly this one I have, but make sure you have a container you can use to fill water. If you know the name of your enemy, you get a, a piece of paper. You're going to get a piece of paper and a biro. Let me get my piece of paper. So you're going to get your piece of paper and your biro. If you know the name of your enemy, or enemies, if you know their names, write their names. If there are more than one, write their names. If it's just one person, you're sure. Maybe in the office, this person don't want you to rest. He or, he or she keep reporting you to the superior authorities. In your business, he or she doesn't want you to sell. He keep disturbing you in your compound. Anything you do, the person must get offended. The person don't even want to see you in your village. The same thing, okay? Don't even bother to go and fight. As I, like I always say, I don't believe in physical fight. Yeah, because some of them will want to kill you with maybe sharp objects. Once you're dead, you're dead. Highest the person will go to prison. And if he or she have money, you'll be free from you know from the crime. So the best thing is to fight your battle spiritually because the spiritual controls the physical. What you're going to do, write the person's name. After writing the person's name, you're going to fold it. Put it inside this bottle of water. Okay? Put it inside this bottle of water container. Take your pepper. Put it inside this way. Then, this is where the spiritual work begins. 
you start shaking it, say you start calling their names as you've written them here. It's one person. I don't want to mention anybody's name because I personally I don't think I have an enemy. Okay, yes. If you declare yourself my you're my enemy, you are gone because I won't even have time for you. Okay, so let me just use uh, hey, what will I use? Let me just use uh, it's, it's Tebo, Mr. Tebo. As you have decided to make me, you know, to use less my life, to gossip me, to make life miserable for me. There's nothing I do that you like. If I pass, you report me. Anything I do, you want to kill me, you want to do this. You know the things your enemies are planning to do uh, to you, okay? Yes, you mention it. Maybe if it's your place of work, the person, is, uh, the person keep reporting you. Or you are due for promotion, the person don't want to approve your promotion. Or in your village, the person just collected your land because he or she feels that they, they have diabolical powers to, you know, to destroy you and you're scared of fighting back. Okay? Yes, you're scared of fighting back. Do not panic. Yes, do not panic. Just do this recipe, write the person's name, but make sure if you're fighting for a land, make sure that land actually belongs to you. Then if you have a case, maybe somebody laid an allegation on you, and you're being detained, or you have a court case, the person lied to you because you maybe you don't have money to even get a lawyer. Okay, you are using your last money to go and, you know, hire a lawyer and start, you know, struggling for things you don't know how to, you know. Maybe the person is suppressing you with his financial capability or his diabolical powers. Just write the person's name here. Or through shaking, as I'm shaking it, shaking your name, let this pepper begin to pepper your body. You will not know peace until you confess. You will not know peace until you leave my matter alone. Until you forget everything that has to do with me. Your, all your body will be full of pepper. From head to toe, all your body will be pending you until you release me. Until you do the right thing. Until you confess your sins. Because some of them have more, uh, used to conspire with people. Yes, there may be two or three conspiring against you to make sure you leave that office, to make sure that this life becomes miserable for you. There was a time I told you a story of my own. There were seven because they know that one of them cannot attack me. That is it. The seven of them conspired. They did their diabolical things without knowing that the God that created me, can nobody can destroy me unless when God says yes. But as I'm talking to you today, all of them, they are looking for a way to make peace. I don't even want to see them in my house. I told them to go that let the, the thing you did to me, I'll return it back to you. So go and face it. Yes, because I didn't do anything to you. My God is fighting my battle. So do the same. Let God fight your battle. You don't need to fight your battle. Leave it up to God to fight for you. You don't need to talk too much. You don't need to. Mm -mm. Just do exactly what I said. After the whole thing, leave this thing until when you get tired, you know, if you want to throw the thing away. But if I wear you, just keep it like this. Let that pepper continue to pepper them until they confess their sins, until they stop disturbing you, until they stop tormenting you. Do this simple recipe and come back for your testimony. I wait your testimony under the comment section or on my WhatsApp number. Thank you for watching the video. i see you in my next video. Bye-bye.